What's up? I just had a brainstorm. Class rep Shinozaki's famous scary time candles. There's not a student in two nine who isn't intimately familiar with them, right? You're kidding. There's not a student in our grade who hasn't seen them at least once. People call you the horror rep of Kurosagi for a reason. So how about... We light some candles all throughout the school building. This will be like a signal flares for Merchita and the others. Let them know that you and me and Miss, and, uh, Miss Shishido are all wi here with them, safe and sound. Seems more like she's just trying to reassure herself that she's okay. But if it makes her feel better. Come on, let's go. Yeah, okay. So, yeah. Save points explained by, uh, <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's, that's fine. Don't worry. I like saving. I might just cut, start cutting saves out. Especially since I'm recording with Fraps, it makes it easier to do editing while I'm recording. So when stuff happens, I can just stop the recording. Uh, I can't really do that with uh, console games because uh, it takes a while to start and stop the recording at that point. But, uh, at least with Fraps, I can just sit there and turn it off and on whenever I please. Interesting. I'm thinking this... It looks like a freaking locker room, so we, people can put their shoes in here. Why would they be running around a school barefoot in their stockings? I have no idea. Alright, well, whatever. Holy crap, death monkeys. What the hell is this? These are human bones. Oh, no. Oh, God, no. Are you alright? Whoa, you just stepped on her, Yoshi. God, I knew you were a jerk, but not that much of a jerk. <laughs> I'll be fine. Just hyperventilating. Or whatever. I skipped over that way too fast. I'm sorry. Uh, I have to, have to find Teach. Yeah. But first... Where the hell is Satoshi? If he were here, I bet, she, I bet Shinozaki would be a whole lot calmer. Along with other people. What are you standing around for? Let's get out of here. Yeah, yeah. D quit yapping. Uh, uh, Kai Shimada. Kai Zami. Did you just hear? We have to get away from here. Okay. Um, so, Kazami. Stuff. Uh, I think I've already gotten all these name tags. They they like to save all the name tags, but uh, if you just go up to the bones, if this is your first time playing the game, go up to the bones and check them. So, okay. Um, the devil is this? Victim memoirs. I ate my friend today. What else was I supposed to do? I was starving. We both were, and there's no food here, so we decided together that one of us should try to live just a little bit longer. If I ever get home, I'm supposed to tell all the people waiting for us what happened. We left it all up to a game of paper, scissors, rock. Or rock, paper, scissors. Loser eats winner. And I lost. I felt her blood going down my throat, quenching my thirst. And her meat was supple and satisfying. But that blood and that meat were once my friend. Up until just a few hours before, I'd been talking with her. As I feasted, I just kept thinking. This food used to be a person. Before I tore it apart, it all worked together to sustain a life. And every time I thought about that, I just started crying and couldn't stop. I wanted some part of her to be with me, even after she died. So I decided to keep one of her... Ew. 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 Disgusting. Okay, I, get, I can understand cannibalism, but keep... Uh, 
that's just disgusting. I'm sorry. I thought maybe I should write all of this down to help preserve some small portion of my sanity. I think you've lost all sanity, dude. There are decaying skeletal remains here, about the size of a middle school. And the process is slowly drying and whitening, creating an almost overpowering stench. Any clothing in the Kate had been wearing is long gone, so there's no means of readily identifying the gender on sight. You're a one sick bastard, you know that. I, I was trying to keep a straight face while reading that, but... Yeah, I couldn't, couldn't anymore. What the hell kind of classroom is this? It's not like any classroom I've ever seen. I don't blame you for puking all over the place, Shinozaki. Ayumi, my head is splitting. Are you okay? We shouldn't be in here. We really shouldn't be here. It looks like there's something in here, though. In the back. Just, I just want to look at it for one second, okay? Oh, God! What the hell? Stay back! Yeah! Don't scare me like that! Jeez! You absolutely positively must not look into his eyes, okay? Huh. Why not his eyes? Okay, I won't look at the guy's eyes, just for your sake, you Yumi. Rusted blood-soaked nail puller sitting on top of the desk. Yeah, sure, why not? Acquired the nail puller. So, yeah. If I remember correctly, bad things happen when you look at the guy in the face. So, uh, eh, I don't want to look at the guy in the face. Not going to. That's actually one of the bad endings of this chapter, if I remember correctly. He takes a look at your eyes and uh, you freaking die. He comes at you with a knife. Or, uh, I don't know about a knife. I think a bloody pair of scissors and try to cut try to cut out your tongue. Yeah, he's one of those kids that got killed with by that guy with the scissors and the tongue and he pulling and yeah. This is actually a lot scarier without music on it. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm serious. The, the sound effects make it all scarier. But uh, like I said, I'm just going to put the background music on it. There's a hastily written note on the ground. Its writers seem to have struggled with it. As the lettering is inconsistent and difficult to read. Why, sister? It hurts. It hurts. After I die, the pain will continue forever. No. No. Oh, God. Please, run away. Red is bad. You're going to leave me behind, aren't you? I will never forgive you. I'm getting out of here. <laughs> I was going to talk to you after I read that note, but... Uh, yeah, okay. TV's still on in there. It, it, yes, I get it. You hate your sister. However, you're a bad brother. Or sister, or whatever. Sibling. I don't know. Gender is not uh, readily available by the fiery flame of death that hovers upon that note now. What is it? Yeah. Ayumi? Are you okay? Or... What? Where are you going? I think she's gonna go puke. The hell was that all about? Ayumi? The hell did you run off to, buddy? Oh, little missy. Are you okay? Shinozaki, there you are. What are you... Whoa, that is really freaking that. No one is saying that! 
really freaky eyes, man. Today is my daughter's birthday. She's turning seven. We're going out together to... Okay, Yumi, how old are you again? I thought you were like 16, man. Or... Yeah. What are you doing? This is dis That's disgusting! Why, why are you both looking at me like that? Uh, Yumi? I, are you okay? Please, say something that's actually constructive, please. What's wrong? Uh, you were saying some pretty weird stuff just now. Was she not aware? Must be the pressure. Her eyes are probably shot all by hell, all to hell by now. Yeah, never mind. Probably just my imagination. Don't worry about it. Those eyes, man. That freaking creeped me out. Yeah. Can I get out of here? Front entry might as well be painted on. No, no, alright, fine. Oh, God. Run away from the kitty! Um, come with me. What's going on? It's pitch black. Shinozaki, Miss Yui, Satoshi, is anyone there? Man, where the hell am I? Was I dreaming or something? I can't move. Feels like... Walls all around me, and am I, am I in a hole or something? <laughs> what the? Who's? Is it dirt? Gravel? From above? I think I know where we are. Stop! I'm alive down here! You planning on suffocating me? My mouth's getting totally filled up. Ugh. Stop this puppet. I can't breathe. Am I going to die like this? Why? Who would? This can't be happening. This isn't funny. Stop it. My eyes are really hurting. Just tell letting you guys know, I did not expect that happening. Yay. I'll meet you back there. Alright, let's try this again. Really? 